Mujib from Nigeria. He says, what is the relationship of a boy who was born out of wedlock? Mujib, there is a difference between a general fatwa and a specific fatwa. So a general fatwa is a fatwa that is given for a particular, for, for a, a, an incident, and 95% fits under this incident. While a specific fatwa is a fatwa tailor-made for a specific case. A man does this, he marries her, she doesn't marry him, she was married before, she is married when she conceives out of wedlock. All of these are different stories, so we don't give tailored-made fatwas, we give general fatwas. So generally speaking, a man has a relationship, an illicit relationship with a woman, she conceives, she gives birth. This boy is born out of wedlock. He does not relate to his biological father. He only relates to his mother, which means that his biological father is not obliged to provide for him to take care of his financial needs. He does not carry his name. The biological father has no right in giving that child born out of wedlock his name. And as a consequence, the child never inherits his biological father because he's not related to him. This is the general fatwa.